if you don't learn how to enjoy your life while you have a problem, you're not going to enjoy too much of it. <laughs> because to be honest, yeah, that's right. I mean, if, if we even wrote down everything that happens to us in one year, we would be astonished at the end of the year that we've still even got sanity. Yeah. <laughs> and, but when we, when we don't think about it all the time and we're not stressed out about it all the time, God works things out in our life. And there's two chapters in this book called Trust God and Do Good. Psalm 37, 3. I love it. It's one of the greatest messages God's ever given me. It's talking about the evil going on in the world and evil people and not, not, to, be, not to fret yourself about evil. And verse 3 says, trust in the Lord and do good. And I think for years, all I saw was trust God. But see, the key is, is you trust God and then you do something to help somebody else or you keep doing what you know you should do, keeping your commitments, being faithful to continue to study the word, trust in the Lord and do good. And then the seeds that you're sowing will bring a harvest in your life at the right time. And I want to say again, when you trust God, there's amazing side effects. <laughs> I mean, it's just phenomenal side effects. Things like peace, joy, less stress. I'm going to say it again. Don't, don't miss this. If you trust God, you can go ahead and enjoy your life while God is working on your problems.